Alfred, hereditary prince of Saxe, Coburg and Gotha, was born on the 15th of October 1874 at Buckingham Palace. He was the eldest child of Prince Alfred, Duke of Edinburgh and later Duke of Saxe, Coburg and Gotha and Grand Duchess Maria Alexandrovna of Russia. Alfred had five siblings, but one of his siblings was stillborn. His surviving siblings were Marie, Victoria, Melita, Alexandra and Beatrice. Alfred's father was one day expected to become the next Duke of Saxe, Coburg and Gotha. So Alfred and his family lived mainly in Germany, occasionally living in the United Kingdom and Malta, depending on where his father was stationed for his job. Alfred later served as a lieutenant in the Prussian First Foot Guards in Potsdam and greatly disliked military life. It is believed that Alfred contracted syphilis during this time. In August 1893, Alfred's grand-uncle, Ernst II, passed away and Alfred's father became the Duke of Saxe, Coburg and Gotha. In early 1895, Alfred became engaged to Duchess Elsa of Württemberg, but the marriage never took place. In January 1899, Alfred was absent from his parents' 25th wedding anniversary. The exact details of what happened are unclear. Some say he had a tumour. Some say he was suffering from a breakdown. Others say he had consumption or that he was suffering from severe side effects of syphilis. The general consensus is that Alfred shot himself while his family gathered for his parents' anniversary celebrations. Alfred survived the initial gunshot and was cared for at Schloss Friedenstein before being transferred to Martinsbrunn Sanatorium. His doctor was against the move, but his mother ordered this to be done because she was embarrassed by what her son had done. Alfred's condition deteriorated and he passed away on the 6th of February 1899 at the age of 24.